cards, ten cards, base, adventures, done. Um, okay, I think that's right, right? Selecting cards, base, adventures, done, ready. Boom! I have learned how this works. Wait, did I mean? Oh, right. My bad. Mm. Alright. Uh, <laughs> sorry, that's just me not knowing uh, any of the rules of the tournament that I signed up for and decided to play today. So, exciting. Base Adventures. I guess I have this problem of I don't actually know um, any of the sets. <laughs> I, I really don't. Um, Okay, so I've got a couple options here. I mean, I'm going to open Amulet. The question is, do I want two Amulets, or do I want a Poacher Amulet? Um, you only buy here looks like Seaway. So I'm going to want at least a couple Poachers. That's probably like the best Seaway target. Um, like, Witches are fine. Royal Carriages here, Labs. I don't really need that many Poachers. A couple Poachers is fine. The curses will run, so it's gonna be piles I have to be worried about. I'm pretty tempted by just doubling amulet. Yeah, let's just do double amulet. That seems fine. Um, I'm not gonna hit witch or anything, but I think the the upside is you can try to hit amulet turn three, and finding amulet turn three is just uh, significantly better than finding amulet not turn three. So double amulet makes your chances of finding turn three amulet significantly higher. And that is the plan. Now, you have high roll, of course, so you find one turn three, one turn four. Low roll is like you find both turn, I guess, five, but... Um, we'll just hope I don't hit them both turn four or five. Hitting them both turn three is a little sad, but it's actually not that big a deal. Um, because they both get shuffled back in, then you're fine. I mean, Poacher Amulet, is, I think, is the other reasonable open here. I think Poacher Amulet versus Double Amulet are both pretty competitive. Um, Poacher Amulet hits five more often, which gets you witches, which is pretty cool. Oh, well, wait, what? That's not... Huh. Well, I said I was... I was <laughs> wait, wait, what? Okay, sure. Um, yeah, that's, that's what just happened. That's very strange. Maybe I just don't get witches. I could just, like, Seaway Poacher right now. Okay. Maybe just Witch there was better. I think Seaway Poacher is fine, though. I want to see it eventually. Maybe Lab was better. I don't know. I'm, um... I, the, the hit with 5 there is just absurd. wasn't really planning on it. Um, and my amulets don't collide, which is pretty good to see. Also, those two cards are Amulet Estate, which guarantees that I get to trash um, Estate next turn which is neato, the technical way to say that is neato. Oh, you found your amulet turn three? But I opened two amulets. I was supposed to find them turn three. That's the reason I opened two of them. Oh, well, that's fine. Play amulet turn four, play one turn five. Uh, Very easy trash here. I mean, I could take a seller. I don't know if seller's any good, though. Like, it's kind of okay. I guess I'll take the seller. It seems I think it's better than nothing. It's not clearly better than nothing, but it's probably better than nothing. Here will be just double trash. I don't think I want a second seller. I think one seller is um, enough sellers. Let's just. I mean, could take a coin and a poacher. It's okay. I'm just gonna trash and buy nothing. Okay. So like right now the seller is not looking very good. Well, maybe I just. I don't know. Do I discard a bunch and trigger the shuffle? I'm not sure the duplicate's doing a whole lot. Trash that. I'm playing the poacher. I mean, tossing three here is perfectly reasonable, I think. Okay, well, I didn't find the amulet, which is what I really wanted to find. Um, 
Hidden Gambit there would have been quite good. I'm just going to sell her, I guess, three copper here. My Ambits are going to collide, but I think it's not the biggest deal. I guess I could... I could toss this amulet also. I have, um... As long as I don't bottom deck my other amulet, it's fine. I mean, no, I can't even bottom deck it. It's fine, too. Um, like, do I trash here? Do I take a... Shoot. Like, I really want, um... I really want to hit five here. I want to trash two. I could take the royal carriage pretty soon would be good. Um... I can also buy like a training. I could just train poacher. Is that any good? Maybe. There's some appeal to it. I really want to trash though. Eh, it's all it's all a little sad. Alright, let's just trash once more. Pick up a I can't play the duplicate. I guess just one more poacher is fine. I don't want like a billion poachers because they're gonna be terrible pretty soon. Um Alright, I'm going to trash here, I think. I could also take a coin first instead of trashing. There's some appeal to that. The, um... I really want to hit... Like, six is a great number to hit here. I would love to hit six. I have three poachers in my deck. Alright, let's take a coin. See what I find. Alright, like, this is a trash, right? And then this is just, like, train the poachers. All right, these poachers are beefy. Look at these poachers, huh? They got a lot going on here. All right, we're going to take um I'm going to take a coin. All right, I guess we're tossing two copper. I'm going to trigger the shuffle, I guess. Um like this could be trash and grab like I guess I'll just take like a coin and take like Carriage Witch is probably fine. How much have you trashed? Hmm, a little less than I have. I like the idea of Carriage Witch right here. Uh, largely because I want to start cursing you. And I need the Carriage mostly for the village effect. I mean, the other effects are fine too, but mostly the village effect. Um, gotta be careful on getting too many poachers in this board. Just because discarding is pretty bad. I need a bunch of labs in my deck, ideally. Um, I could grab a duplicate at some point soon, too. Alright, carriage, play you. We're going to call the carriage. I think I'm always playing it like this, right? 8, 9, 10, 11? Um, what am I going to take here? I kind of want a relic, too, just for the attack. I mean, 10 is a pretty decent number, right? So trash that nonsense. Um, let's get like carriage duplicate right now. Carriage duplicate has a lot of appeal as well. Um, yeah, I think I want the dupe. I think the upside of that is pretty solid. Oh, this is not what I wanted to see, is it? Hmm, interesting. I think I don't trash here. I'm gonna take a coin. I mean, Killerhearts has a good amount of stuff in their deck. They have a lot more junk too, though. But they also have, like, the two labs, which are really good. I definitely want some labs. Alright, we're gonna do this. I guess just toss two. I'm not gonna call Carriage on that one. Uh, we're not gonna call Carriage on at least one of these, though. Ah, shoot. Missed. That was actually bad order, right? That order was not good. Um, I think I'm going to curse you again. And nine. Do I want to trash a copper or do I want to get an extra thing down? I'll just get an extra thing down. Um, I'm going to get a lab, which gets duplicated. And then I'm going to pick up another carriage, I guess. All right. I'm in decent shape here. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm in pretty good shape. All right, we're going to play Lab. I'm going to call Carriage on a Lab. I do need, like, some of this stuff. This seller's going to toss three cards. All right, that one. That one. I said to call one Carriage here. I'm going to call Carriage on the Witch now, I think. 
So amulet eight, nine, ten. I guess I can trash here. No, if I trash, I don't get the extra coin though. Just gain a silver. Well, I guess if I had, I could also take like a second dupe if I just trash. That gives me nine. That seems fine. I'll give you another purse here. Get the duplicate. Continue and get the carriage, which I will duplicate. All right, things are looking pretty much one. Mm. Pretty solid position. Do I take silver this turn or no? I guess I take a silver here. My draw is now really good. It's probably fine to take silver at this point. All right, call call a carriage at least once on that. Let's call a second carriage on that. I don't need more draw though, right? So okay. So I get to play a witch. Um. And you have a moat. Okay, so I guess I'm not doing that. I will play the poacher to call a carriage. I can leave the carriages there now that you have a moat in your hand. 8, 9, 10, 11. Like, does 13 do anything for me? Not really. Yeah, they don't really do anything to play those, so just play those. This one can just trash this one there. Uh, end actions. And we're going to pick up another lab. And do I want like I kinda want a relic. The relic is pretty good. I can get a, a lab and like two relics. I do need some economy in my deck. I'll get more economy though, just off of um silvers from amulets though. I'll have to trade I'll have to trash a little bit. Yeah, the piles are definitely getting a little low. It's not like super scary though. The goal here being just, um, if I don't plug in some silvers, thin down a bit, keep my economy going. All right, I'll take two purses here, I guess. Um, hopefully, you don't have your moat in hand next turn, though. That would be ideal. I can't win here, can I? Recurses, I get to duplicate some stuff. Eh. I don't think I can win here. Maybe I can. I have four buys. The curses will run. I don't know if I have enough economy for it all, though. Maybe I do. I'll have to take a look what happens when I draw. There might be a win. Although, if you province now, it's going to be a little harder for me. All right. You're very. You, you're only like one in a very small number to find your moat this turn, right? If you don't province, uh, I don't know. I don't know what happens if you don't province. Ooh, two labs. Well, I can, I mean, like, I just win here, though, right? Maybe you're playing for a dud? But, like, I just need to find, like, five coins and I win. All right, we'll call one carriage. I don't think you need to call more carriages on the labs, right? Because I should have enough draw to get through this all, I think. Yeah. Um, I have to discard a card now, huh? Okay, fine. Maybe that's why you took the labs to make me discard. It's possible. So I can play this. I'm just gonna play this poacher to discard. Um, maybe I do need to actually carriage. In their lab. All right, that's fine. And then I'm just gonna play the witch. So like, as long as I, as long as you don't have a moat in hand, this wins. Although I think it wins without a moat in hand too, right? If I play the poacher. Well, I can play the witch first, right? If I call two more of these things. 
And then I should have enough money here to just go. Carriage is to discard this. I have to discard two now. Oh, whatever, it's fine. Um, and then I have to call carriage again and discard those two. Go to duplicates, play this for a coin or whatever. I don't know. Um, just play that to follow dupe and call it dupe and buy a province. I don't know, whatever. I'm not going to stop a few actions ago. Okay, um, that's one for me. Mm. All right. Your pick. And Kyoto goes first for game two. Hmm. I wonder if there's a strategy. It feels like there's probably a strategy that I don't understand. Like, um, Ren, like, I, do I like the game less powerful, right? So, like, Ren and Nocturne, maybe? Ren Nocturne. Um, selecting cards. Not you, not you. Nocturne and Renaissance. Let's go. Can't select promos, can I? All right. Mm, start the game. Oh, hello. Uh, yep, this sure does look like Renaissance. <laughs> yeah, well. Um, like, Cathedral Open sounds like a lot of fun to me. Next turn's a three, which is a little sad. But, like, I don't know, I can... I could not take... Uh, I mean, there's, like, a consideration of not opening Cathedral here, right? I can take it next turn. It's not, like, what is this board even doing? It's not even, like, a very good board. There's no draw. I mean, I guess Wisps draw. You get enough of them. Hard to get that many Wisps, though. It's, like, hard to trash with the Cathedral stuff. The Cathedral's just too strong. Like, Puka draws. I think that's some... Or, like, yeah, this is just a really... It's not actually that spicy of a board, is it? All right, well, I'm just going to open Cat Silver, maybe, is fine. Ugh. I don't want the Inventor is the problem. I think having the four next hand would be better. Cat Inventor is pretty solid. I think Cat Silver is fine. Um, I'm just stuck with three this turn is the unfortunate part. But Silver is fine. I could also pick, like, Cave or something. Stupid. Puka at some point might be reason. I don't know. It's hard ever hard to justify like the trashers on this board because there's no draw, and you're already um, playing Cathedral every turn, so you're already starting like with four card hands. So you're trashing a card. I mean, Puka draws stuff too, but you're not gonna have Copper forever. Yeah, I think Cathedral Gold is actually not even that crazy, just like Gold right now. Although I'm not sure that's better than. Um, just, like, silver and not take the curse. Alright, this will be, I guess, Inventor? I don't know. I need to pop lamp, but, like, what the heck are you doing? It's, like, the weakest Ren board, which I guess is what I get for picking, for picking Nocturne. <laughs> um, two Inventors? Oh, that's weird. Do you actually want that many Inventors? I don't think you do. Uh, sure, I'll grab an Inventor. Like, I don't know. Do I just take, um... I take like a cave here. Okay. I don't really want to take curses. Inventing acting troops. I'm not sure exactly what Killer Arts is doing. Sure, assist. Um, I mean I guess if you're I guess maybe the goal is to use XO for just like all the games. So like you're you're inventing a bunch of stuff and then you're exercising it to get wisps and whatnot. I mean there's probably like a lot of upside to doing that. I do want to just, um, I'm going to pop this stupid first gold, just take a cave. I'm just trying to avoid hitting, uh, uh, getting cursed in my deck yet. I'll get them soon, maybe, I don't know. Mostly I just want to thin down and try to pop lamp and then figure out the rest of my plan. Maybe involve spirits. I guess it, there's a good chance it involves spirits. Um, it's a little awkward if you play too many inventors. 
Okay, like, don't discard this. Pick me up. Um, ah, I don't know, even. Like, another inventor is okay, but it doesn't help me pop a lamp. Exorcist doesn't really help me pop a lamp either, though, is the problem. Maybe just Border Guard? Maybe I should have discarded. Nah, it doesn't really do anything to discard, does it? Um, second inventor is a little awkward. Border Guard's pretty good. Drew doesn't do anything. One, two, three. One, two, three. Four. Five. I do have six cards if I can get to them. I'm just going to take the Border Guard, I think. Try to pop lamp this turn. Um, oh, sorry, maybe uh, not this turn, not next turn. Um, I do want maybe another inventor now. Like an inventor exorcist right now is okay. I would actually like draw cards at some point. But I guess maybe another maybe the acting troop is better. Cause I'm gonna have two I'm gonna have two inventors in this shuffle, right? So might as well have an acting troop in there. Alright. Let's see if we can't um one, two, three. No, I can't ever pop Pop Lamp is so freaking hard. <laughs> It's not impossible, it's just really hard. I can probably pop it this turn, right? There's like a decent there's a chance I can pop it this turn. It's just difficult. Alright, play the cave. Ah, no! That was the card I can't stand to draw that one. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Yeah, drawing copper was like the one I couldn't draw. That was like the only card I can't draw there to pop is the copper. No, I guess the uh, acting trip would also not have popped. It's like wet. It's a lot of inventors. I'm not entirely clear what these inventors are doing. Like a couple inventors seems fine. At some point, I need to pop. None of this is helping me pop. All right, I'll take a third inventor, I guess. And do I want another border guard? I got. Ah, when do I ever pop? I never pop. Oh no! Disaster has struck. Um, do I kill the curse gold now? Do I kill the acting troop now? Maybe I kill the acting troop. No, I need the acting troop, I think. I have like a bunch of inventors now. I don't know what my deck's gonna do at this point. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, the imps are really cool. I kinda wish I had imps. I have a hard time imagining Killer's deck doing that much, but maybe it comes together. I mean, I could also kill the inventor. I don't like need that many inventors. I could kill the acting troop. I'm just gonna kill the acting troop. It's fine. Um, one, no, it doesn't do anything, so we'll take the border guard. I guess we're taking the silver here, right? Yeah. All right, we're going to invent, um, I guess another inventor is fine. Just take the last one. Do I take this puka? I could take the puka. I also need their acting troop because I just trashed mine. I have a lot of inventors. Um, I could also take, like, the gold. That helps me activate. I don't know what I'm doing, other than, like, it just seems really bad. <laughs> What I'm doing just seems bad. Um, at some point I want an exorcist, but do I want one right now? Yeah, I guess I'll take an exorcist now. Okay, well this is why I need that acting troop. This is why you need the acting troop! <laughs> I guess I'll just take an acting troop here, and like, uh, I don't know, another border guard. I don't think I'm ever popping this thing. The way I'm playing this just doesn't make any sense at all. I think that's what's happening. Um, I was kind of hoping for, like, a better draw at some point, and that didn't happen, and now I'm just in a weird spot. Let's grab a couple acting troops. I don't know. At some point, like, I might draw, and might might pop a lamp. I'm still hoping to pop a lamp. It's just not looking great right now. Grab a couple acting troops. Okay, maybe this pops. Mm, no, this, not, this never pops here, right? Can't pop. Well, can I... No, we can't ever pop. All right, I need to, I need to get a wisp or an imp in my deck. I think that's actually really important. I wonder if you're popping this turn. I could have popped like a hundred turns ago if I just drew slightly better. Okay, so is this game like ending then? Are we just rushing piles? I don't know what's happening. I'm just so very confused. All right, border guard, pick up the um, I don't know. Pick up the inventor is fine. Border guard, pick up the um, the cursed gold. 
Or I need to get that acting troop employed, but what am I going to kill with its extra assist? Ugh. Everything seems terrible. I could kill the exorcist for an imp, right? Sure, let's just do it like that. Um, I think I'll just not play the exorcist, which is fine. I, like, desperately need an imp. I should have played this board significantly different. Ah, no! What is this? This doesn't look great. Oh, the cathedral doing its thing, right? <laughs> Ooh, that Puka's nice. Um, you don't win here, do you? You might win here. No, you need more inventors in play. You don't have enough. I don't need this acting troop, right? All right, well, you're just loading your deck with duchies, which might work. I don't know. I'm going to trash the acting troop. We're going to play the cave. Don't discard. You're going to pick me up, um... Well, there's a lot of inventors. I could also grab, like, another Imp or a Wisp. I did kill Inventor to do it, though. What if I invented, um, a Research? Invented a Duchy? Invented a Gold? Doesn't sound... None of that sounds good, though, is the problem. I'm just gonna play the Extra Assist. Pick me up, like, this Research, I guess? Or do I, like, pick up a Silver Puka and I trash the Silver? That seems fine, too. Um, I mean, you could take the duchy. Do I need the duchy? The problem with Pook is I can't... I don't, like, actually draw that. I don't have any treasure in my deck. I don't think the Pook does enough. Um, Like, I could just put up the duchy just because it's there. Nothing else is doing a whole lot. Could I get Changeling? Nah, whatever. Alright, grab me a Wisp this time. Okay. I get to activate this turn. Like, almost certainly. Um, and hopefully the Wishes just win the game. That's my hope. We have a lot of, uh, we have a lot of villagers. I wonder if you could just, like, start blitzing the border guards. Can I stop that? I'm not sure I can stop that. Well, also, you might just be able to blitz the duchies. I'm hoping I can just wish for provinces. That would be ideal. Imp the, um, Wisp, I guess? That order was not good. That order was bad. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can't take the inventor, right? Okay, fine. Uh, don't discard. One, two, three. I could discard here. Or I could just exercise the cursed gold, which seems pretty good. Sure. Uh, I'm going to invent a... Uh... Oh, boy. What do we even invent here? Changing doesn't do enough. Drew gives me plus buy, which might be okay. Silver gives me economy, which is probably better. I don't have that draw is the problem. So the secret cave is innocuous. I'm not gonna silver. One, two, three, four, five. Magic lamp does that. I'm not gonna spend this, right? So we're just gonna exercise this into another imp. Uh, top deck the border guard, and I'm hoping I can win this turn. If your turn's not very good, I can probably win. Um, I like trash. Do I trash the silver? Probably just trash the silver. A little unclear, but probably. I just want to see more cards. All right, what are the winning tail here? I need to like score eleven points. That's a lot of points. All right, play this one. Okay, that's great. Don't discard. Border guard does not find an inventor, unfortunately. I'm taking the wisp. I'm going to. Play the inventor first here, almost always. Um, so I have a couple options for how to win from this position. I need to score 11 points, right? So that is, um, what if I got four border guards? Do I have enough to get four border guards? I don't think so. I think I just need to get um, the three duchies. Yeah, I just take the estate here. Okay, so this just wins, right? I invent a duchy, I wish for two duchies, I buy a, a 
No, I'm short though. That's short. That looks short. Um, I can invent a duchy. Oh, wait, no, this works. I can actually as a wish, wish for province. Invent a duchy. So I get to wish for. No, if I wish for duchy, duchy buy a state that's a tie. Hmm. Do I take a tie? I could not take a tie. Because I could also take like. Um, I could also take two provinces. Like, what if I just took two provinces here and said? <sighs> Interesting conundrum. Take two provinces. Like, can I win from that position? That's twelve. Take two provinces in a state, right? And that would give me. I always wish for a duchy next turn too. So if I take two provinces in a state, that's twelve, thirteen points, which means twenty. Um, which means you would need to score quite a. Bit. Well, two duchies in the state would beat would beat that though. Hmm, two duchies in the state does beat that. I don't know. What if you just two your turn? Not a whole lot. Your turn's actually probably pretty good. Ah, shoot. Like you didn't. Your last turn was really bad, right? So you probably have a good stuff in your hand. You have eleven. Like you, all you need to do is find like three inventors and you win, which is not unreasonable. So I think we're just gonna go for the tie. I'm one coin short of winning here. Oh well, that's fine. And we should open top like that. Yeah, well. You know. I guess it's fine to tie a second player. Alright, um. Advanced options, player order, that's me. Let's go with, uh, what do I want? Let's consider Menagerie, maybe? Empires, maybe Empires. I think it's gonna be Menagerie Empires. I wanna play one of those sets as first player. All right, you pick men, you pick Ren, I pick men. Ren, ooh, Mendia. Menda. Alright, we're playing Menda here. Selecting new cards. Menda. Um, and we have to make shelters random off that, right? No, hold on. Shelters just says on random. There's not hold on. What's the rules in shelters? Real quick, let me just see. I think you leave uh shelters or yeah, just keep them random. Okay, done. Yeah, okay. Uh yep. Okay. Three, four. Oh, come on. You gave me the bad start. You gave me the bad start. Four, three is like Bounty Hunter March, which seems super great. Um, I mean, Silver Bounty Hunter is fine. I'm not taking. Armory is also pretty good on open. I could. I mean, like, oh man, Armory March actually looks like a really good open on the four, three. Shoot. I would have liked Armory March. Um, Armory March would have been super duper good, I think. Uh, Bounty Hunter is also fine. I think this is gonna be. I think it's just bounty hunter. The nice thing about bounty hunter is it spikes some big price points, so you can pursue. Uh, yeah. I do want armory soon. I think armory's just good for hit picking up all the fours, which are good. Although I don't need that many fours. I, I do want like a lot of fives, but the fours are also really good. All right, I'm just bounty hunter. Okay, like this is six, right? So this will probably be pursue armory. Um, so that was actually a really really good one. Pursue. First, take the armory now, I think. I guess this is armory now. Yeah, sure. All right, five here is going to be... I don't know. Paddock is really good. Um, I think it's Paddock. It could be Catacombs. Like, the plan here is that I'm... Well, I might end up just marching whatever I buy here, right? So I can take a Paddock and then march it. Some horses seems pretty good. All right, we'll do that. Okay, well, this is fine. I'm there's also the, the possibility of me um, not buying anything. I guess I could exile the estate and then pursue whatever I top deck. 
That does trigger this shuffle, which is that, is that good or bad? Nah, I think we're just going to do like this. Armory to grab ourselves an Ironmonger, and is it better to... Do I want two horses, or do I want a four cost? Um, I have a feeling I want two horses, right? Pretty sure I want two horses here. Although do I have, I have two, ah. The Ironmonger might do some stuff. Village Green is also fine. Ironmonger is also fine too. Um, dude, I don't know if I want Ironmonger here or not. I really kind of want two horses. Where's the Ironmonger? Is there another Ironmonger? I'm not sure that's correct or not, but maybe it's fine. Um, Ironmonger, discard that one for sure. All right, I get to pursue here if I want to. Like, I could pursue. I don't think I want to, though. Like, those are, like, very good cards, right? So we're just going to grab myself a, um... Yeah, another Ironmonger, maybe. Another Paddock is fine. At some point, these Ironmongers have to actually hit things. Hopefully this Ironmonger... I don't know. I don't have to play this Ironmonger now. Hmm... Like, if it draws the Paddock, I'd probably just play Paddock. If it hits the Paddock, it's fine, too, I guess. So, whatever. All right, so keep that there. I get to Bounty Hunt an Estate. I get to Armory. Um, I have a lot of Paddocks. I think I want to Village Green now. Lies. All right, your horse situation's a lot better than mine, huh? Maybe I should, maybe, I think the two horses was better that turn a while ago. I don't regret my decision. Ironmonger, discard, play the paddock. Um, I'm gonna grab another paddock, I guess. Oof, look at them horses. Look at them horses. I don't think I'm ahead. Oh, that's right, you get to, um, you can do that stuff, which is kind of cool. All right, well, we're keeping that there. Yeah, it gets taken for sure. Armory gains a village green. Because I think what I can do is pursue. I don't know, I kind of want some other stuff too now. More paddocks is fine. Pursue is nice, um, just because it lets me discard a bunch of stuff. I can pursue horse, and it draws pretty well. And then buy like none of the other stuff is all that exciting to me though. It's only a single game mill board or single buy board. There's games you can get. But there's only one buy. So yeah, we're gonna pursue. Um, where's horse? Horse. I can't just click on horse. I have to type horse in. Um, we're back to Village Green. We'll next turn that. And four here is going to pick me up a... I could take a second Armory. That's probably too much Armorying. It's a little sad to discard that. Uh, let's get another Village Green. Mm. Yeah, like I need to start provincing before too long here. There's only so much you can actually build on this board. Looks like Killhurts is drawing deck here. I'm hoping my armory is enough to give me the edge. Um, the armory definitely helps a lot. The province here is not, not even unreasonable. All right. Um, yeah, play that one. Play that one. Play that one. Grab a couple paddocks into the shuffle. Play you. Play you. Um. So we have to play that now. I play that one. I'm oh, sorry, un can I undo that play? I don't want to play that. Um, I'm going to armory first here. First up, we're going to armory for a um, village green, I think. Now we draw it. Now we go next turn. Bounty hunt this thing. Play the paddock. Grab myself a pursue on horses. Uh, which is, okay, fine. Take that. Alright, I'm pretty sure the armory wins this game. I kind of want a second bounty hunter, actually. 
Like, I need to get rid of more stuff in my deck. I'm not quite drawing my deck yet, though, is the thing. Um, I guess playing Ironmonger first here. Yeah, we'll keep that horse alive. That one, Ironmonger. Yeah, I guess we're keeping the Bounty Hunter. Don't have to. I'm gonna keep it. It's probably pretty important to exile some stuff. Sure. What's down there? Mm, it's a lot of stop cards, right? Let's pursue a horse. Um, Village Green gets next turned. Village Green gets next turned. Um, I get to pursue again for horse, right? All right, village. Do I even want to react this village green? I don't really have to. Eh. Nah. Well, sure, whatever. Just next turn it. All right, I'm taking um, taking a state with my bounty hunter this turn. I mean, I have the extra paddock too. Um, but I don't think it matters. I think we're just always drawing deck here. Although your deck's a little bit worse than mine. One, two, three, four, five. Um. Okay, six. Okay. I don't have a. Yeah, I don't have a All right, we're gonna just do that. Work. That's fine. Uh, this armory will pick up an estate. No, we're not discarding nothing nice. I'll get out of here. Uh, paddock, 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 ironmonger, keep the horses. Village green goes next turn. Bounty hunter hits the estate here because I don't really need to do anything else. Takes the province, and then I guess we're going to end up du du uh, duchy dancing a bit. I guess we're going duchy dancing. I can actually take a second bounty hunter because, like, I want to keep my deck cleaner and cleaner. I'm just going to take a province. Okay, sure. Horse, 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 ironmonger, keep, ironmonger, discard. Okay. Um, turns out plus gains are cool. Okay. Um, uh, GG. Advanced option. Player order. Killhertz goes last for the final game of the set. And what will it be? My prediction is Empires. If you... I'm gonna pick, like, um... I don't know. Prosperity is cool. Um... Guilds is cool. We picked Menagerie, Renaissance, Nocturne, and Empires, right? Oh, and Adventures. So, Dark Ages. Um, and Base. We picked Base. Didn't we? Didn't I pick Base first? I think I did. Promos? Is that a... Hold on, can you pick Promos? Oh, you can. Okay, I guess we're picking promos. That means whatever I pick has a lot of that thing in it, right? Um. Oh, that's weird. I could grab, like, prosperity and promos. I could grab, a, um, guilds and promos. I don't know. What goes with promos? Mm, we're taking prosperity. No, I'm going to take seaside. Let's take seaside. All right, Romos and Seaside. Looking for some ambassadors. Wait, maybe Seaside was a mistake, actually. I could believe Seaside's mistake with Promos, because, like, Ambassador has a high chance of appearing, and Player 2 does not want Ambassador. But alas, there is... No oh, God, what's this nonsense? <laughs> Cover her ghost ship? Okay, sure. We're opening Lookout Silver, I guess? Like, Cut Purse has some utility, but... Well... I don't know, like, I think your terminal is definitely a ghost ship, right? You're playing with a bunch of governors and a ghost ship. 
Um, Cupbearers has the advantage of being a four cost for later on, which is okay. Um, God, this deck's this is terrible. <laughs> I guess you could play with treasure map too. Want to get some golds? Anyway, I'm opening lookout for sure. Maybe it's double lookout. Double lookout's got utility also. Um. I don't know. Double lookout or silver. I'm always taking one lookout, right? But I want two lookouts. Double silver? That's a bold play, isn't it? Double silver seems like a very bold play. Not sure about that. Yeah, definitely not sure about silver, silver. I think silver lookout's better. I want a second lookout. No, you found a ghost ship. I don't I don't find an estate, which is unfortunate. It means I don't hit five next turn, which is actually really sad. I have a second lookout. That was actually like very bad case draws for me. Very, very bad case draws for me. Oh come on! Really? I don't know what to do here. A haven now, I guess. Like my draws here are just really really shitty. I wanna hit five. Like you hit Okay, like I haven't hit five yet. Um, you've hit five three times to my zero times. I assume the ghost ship's coming this turn. Ah, I'm really, really annoyed by that whole turn of events. I guess we're doing it like this. Trash the estate, top deck that stuff. We're just setting aside the silver. Um, oh, I missed five again? Are you kidding me? Oh no, I don't. Okay, we're fine. I was getting like a little peeved there. All right, trash. This will be a gov. I sure am like losing the governor's split pretty hard right now. Where's my good cards? I feel like I'm not drawing at all. It's pretty annoying. <laughs> ah shoot. All right, I'll find some stuff here. Right, I'm just gonna pop duck. Okay, where's my governor? It's very, very annoying to not find governor here. <laughs> I feel like I'm trying so bad. Maybe the double silver was... I mean, no. Silver lookout hits five reasonably often, and just missing five over and over and over again is just terrible. I missed my governor, which is, like, absolutely absurd. Um... Like, missing governor is just doesn't make any sense at all to me. Like, how do you miss governor there? Like, that's these draws are horrendous. Absolutely god awful. <laughs> how are you gonna miss governor? Come on. Alright, trash you, discard that. Trash you, discard that. Pick up that. Like, I literally can't draw at all here. It's really absurd. Really, really absurd, like the draws. All right, let's top those three, I guess, or four. I'm gonna draw with one of these, right? So it's gonna be one, two, three, four. Probably playing the lookout. I cannot get rid of these silver. Huh. Yeah, sure, whatever. I get to trash that. Discard you. This governor's gonna draw. That's called the copper, sure. You have another governor, I guess. Where's my governors? <laughs> um, like my like I'm trying to imagine worse draws for this board. When I'm having trouble finding them. Having trouble finding worse draws. Although I think Kilohertz is not building nearly enough. Like, you should be building a lot more than you are. I trashed this one into a treasure map. Um, one, two, three. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna trash one silver, I guess. I don't need that many silvers. Draw. Um. Haven. 
that one aside. The governor gets to trash and getting you into a governor. Like, I need to figure out how I'm going to win this game, which I, there's no way I win this game. Like, absolute tip, absolute shit draws. <laughs> Alright, well, this looks a lot better. Okay, but I mean, like, how am I possibly going to outscore here? There's no, there's no way. Wait, hold on, can I, I should have undone that. I did, I did that wrong. Plus three cards. Governor. Trashing game you into a governor. This governor gets to gain a gold. And this is going to buy a treasure map. Yeah, like, I don't know. Is there a way to have worse draws than I did? I don't think there is. But, like, I don't know. Blizzard's just underplaying this just so much. You could be doing a lot of gain and play with these governors. Like, the provinces were way too soon. I mean, it doesn't matter. I can't possibly win from here. Governor. Trash and gain. Silver. Into a, um... Governor. Haven sets aside a Haven. Governor gets the trashing game silver into that one. Playing those ones. This one will buy me, I guess, a duchy. But, like, I'm not scoring 20-something points here. I can get two provinces. Uh, don't trash. All right, well, that should be enough for you to win, then. Oh, you're just stopping there? You have a province in hand, I guess? Yeah, sure. Whatever. Draw some cards. Draw some cards. Oh, I just literally missed all my governors. Sure. Why not? Trash and gain silver. Yeah, this game was just... Uh, I don't know. I don't think there's anything I could have done this game. Buy the duchy. Alright, GG's. Cool. Uh, all right, that's my first match for for this whole thing, I guess. Um, till next time.